Washington is set to hire Fresno State head coach Kalen DeBoer. DeBoer has been successful basically everywhere he's been in a coordinator role and now as a head coach. He's at, He's been at Fresno for the last two seasons and been really, really good. Fresno has done awesome things this season. They, they're getting a good one here. Kalen DeBoer was the OC that really kind of transformed things at Indiana. And once he left, it, things kind of went back into the tank again, as you saw this season. They were able to keep things going uh, last year after he left, but... He came into Indiana, showed them what to do on the offensive side of the ball, and after that, they hired somebody that did not know how to keep that thing going. But DeBoer, under Jeff Tedford at Fresno State, they were incredible. at Their numbers against the spread, which lets you know how much better they were than expectations, they were absolutely rolling for two years. And then he left, and that program tanked, and Tedford ended up retiring. Uh, or resigning, or whatever you want to call it. But Tedford uh, retired, and then DeBoer brought Indiana to New Heights, and then he went back to Fresno State, and Indiana dropped off again, and now Fresno State is sitting on a nine-win season, and now he's going to be the Washington head coach. Washington going the exact opposite of what they did, right? They went with Jimmy Lake, who is known for defense, etc., was not able to get it done, and the offense had problems all season, now you're going to go out and hire an offensive coach. This is what Chris has talked about on this show multiple times about going the opposite of the way that you were going. You do something that did not work, i.e. hiring a defensive guy. So now you're going to go back the other direction. And I like it. I think DeBoer can be really successful. Washington had to make some kind of a change, some kind of a splash hire in order to be successful. And DeBoer knows what he's doing. He knows what he's doing. He knows that area of the country. I think he's going to be really successful. So we shall see you with that. Thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com. And if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter at GaryWCE, at ChrisBGiannini, at Winning Cures, or you can email us, Gary at winningcureseverything.com or Chris at winningcureseverything.com. Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.